Okay, and something that uh, we think that can also improve the user experience is like a, now having a summary screen with the, all the errors during the data entry, right? So if, uh, for instance, I am like creating a new TI now in this program that I can create without before searching. So I create a new TI, click on accept, the enrollment date. And now let's say that, okay, I am not uh, adding any more data and I'm just click on the save button. So then a new menu show up here with all the problems that has been encountered. In this case, we have problems with a lot of mandatory fields that hasn't been filled, like the unique ID, the first name, the last name, the birth date. And then also you can have warnings if you have implemented this with the program rules that basically the birth date it says that the, the woman's up age is outside the normal range. With, uh, with the birth date entered, the age would be zero. Okay, so it says that, okay, be careful because uh, based on a program rule, uh, you shouldn't have like a age that they are zero. You, you should have uh, about greater than, than zero one and so forth, right? So all the issues, errors with the mandatory errors that are coming from the program rules or, or, or uh, conflicts or, uh, or issues that are coming from the, from the warnings that are coming from the program rules, it can be, it will be related here. If you click on review, this will mark the ones having the issues uh, in the with this red label, this field is mandatory. This is field is mandatory, and also this field is mandatory here with the for the chosen date. Okay, let's continue. Uh, 